Yebo, yes, my Africa, Bohamata. You guys discovered how tradition and music amalgamate. Hanachena Kutubwalemutu, who is actually one of the biggest strippers in South Africa, because this person is the one that makes sure you're not fashion in Ritzabang. Because you can see, I'm looking delicious today, and that is the person that is responsible for that. So, when we look at the table, Abuti, Kiko Pare, Amohele, Abutu Arona, the one and only Otoa. To be chow! I'm great. My guy, how you doing? More to dance, more to dance. Listen, I'm told. But I know that some of my HNNs out there are trying to figure out it's like, it's like, how is George that good looking in those clothes? My brother, how did you come up with this outfit? The patterns, the mosaic, the stained glass effect? Well, look, um, the, the pattern actually uh, it's something that. I fell in love with sure. when I actually just saw it. And that's the great thing about being a designer is that you know once it speaks to you, sure. you actually you feel it. And then you immediately know what you're gonna do with, with it, you know. So designing your your outfit today was actually so great. And your top is actually one of our um, trending uh, what you call items. Oh, yeah. well, that's actually very amazing. I heard you speaking about feeling that you know what ah, when you were deciding this, you were feeling. But I know that you can't just go through life feeling. You need a little bit of skill. So I want to find out from you, did you go to school to study how to become a fashion designer? I learned on the job. I Are you on the serious? Job. Yeah, I mean I learned on the job. Um, I never planned to be a fashion designer. Sure, sure. I had one jacket made and everyone just loved that jacket. And then I decided, okay, what about let me just make them. Mm. And then from one jacket, and then I decided, oh no, I want to make this item, this item, sure. then it became a label. Away. And then from a label it became a, a, a studio. Now we have our own factory studio. We make our own clothing, we've got a full staff there, we've got uh, pattern makers, mm. we, we have um, people behind the machines. I've got a great team actually. That actually, speaking about team, you just like unkileman to out of my mouth because I, like, I, I would believe that you're not doing all of this by yourself, which also means that there's so many jobs in design. Do you mind just walking us through some of the like important roles in the design world that h and can become? Number one, go to school and study fashion. <laughs> That's very important. Sure, sure. Um, then you will learn a lot of things when you go for, uh, to, to school. Um, y then you won't have to actually... Um, Just design. Yeah, you know. It seems stressy. And, and it's not going to be as hard as I, I, I got it. You know, sure, sure. you will learn at school. You can do pattern making. You can be a garment technologist. You can be a buyer. You can be a planner. Mm. You can be a, a, a lot of things, basically. That is amazing. You can simply just... A study and then own your own boutique, you can own your own through it, you can own your own Woolworths. I mean, you, you can do I your mean, everything. I, mean. I know that you're not even yet because you still need to make me look nicer for the performance later on. Impahana Chenam Hotsuaka Angie is on the other side. Once I will learn a man in the Emma you're trying to figure out to get like who is your style guru if not me? Angie, what go on? <laughs> 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 <laughs>